Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How does capital gains tax work on real estate? When you sell a property, you might make a profit. This profit is called a capital gain. So what's next? Uncle Sam wants a piece of the pie. That's where capital gains tax comes into play. Capital gains tax is a levy on the profit from the sale of property or investments. For real estate, it's not as simple as taxing any profit you make. There are rules. And oh boy, the IRS loves its rules. If you've owned and lived in your home for at least two of the last five years, you may be in luck. There's an exclusion. For single filers, you can exclude up to $250,000 of the gain. For married couples filing jointly, make it double, up to $500,000. But what if it's not your primary residence? or you've hit the jackpot with your investments. Then, the taxman cometh. Long-term capital gains tax rates could apply. These are for assets held longer than a year. The rate isn't a flat fee. It can vary based on your taxable income and filing status. The IRS has brackets for these and they can change, so always check the latest. What about losses? They can offset gains. This can reduce your taxable income. But remember, there are limits and conditions. And don't forget about state taxes. Some states also want a share of your capital gains. To navigate this tax terrain, consult a tax professional. They can help you understand your specific situation. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.